Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a small recap on Shingeki no Kyojin or Attack on Titan, which is on episode 21. Those of you who've been keeping up with my channel will understand that I'm just doing this for fun. Nothing more, nothing less. And just prepping up for season 2 that is to come about next month, around April 1st. April Fool's Day. Who don't know? Who knows if that thing's gonna be coming out, but yaddy yaddy do. So if anything else, like, um, let's just get this started. We have to it that Erwin Smith has a stop, small talk with Hanji, Hanji about, like, Levi supplying. As Erwin tells, um, Hanji about, Hanji's, Hanji Zoe about, like, um, the uh, female Titan user is still out of the steam and took advantage of that, you know? For them to have a more better experience idea than Eren was a mistake. And right now I told Levi to resupply because this person might be on, is being a spy among our crew, amongst the Survey Corps crew, you know? And therefore his theory was correct, not to mention Hanji's original theory was correct either way. We have to it that, um, both, that the female Titan who killed Gunther last in the last episode um, ends up becoming the female Titan and later on tries to chase down Eren, of course. However, the Servant Corps, the Levi squad, tells Eren to go on ahead, you know, because his power is too risky. Although, as much hesitation, Eren decides to trust in their abilities and they end up taking on the female Titan. Of course, that consists of Oslo, Petra, and Eldo, you know. And when they took her, not, took, took her on, they had no problem. But eventually, you know, Aaron is going to keep is going to keep moving forward. But we have to that believing in his comrades was a good idea. But he remembers Levi's words right now. I don't know what the best answer is. I never have. Either I trust in my comrades or believe in my own abilities. The result will always be a mystery. And therefore, when Eren turns around, the female Titan ends up biting Eld in half and spits him out, you know? Because she used all her healing acceleration on one eye to see and kills Petra, and Oslo tries to take a, tries to take a killing blow, but she shields her nape and then, like, um, ends up getting, how am I supposed to say it, killed in the process. Eren, in total rage, Total Rage transforms into a Titan and tries to take her on, but she ends up dodging his attacks and when they finally got into a point where they could actually fight equal grounds, Eren looked like gotten very tired from swinging around too much and hits a tree, hits a tree where the female Titan like dodges his kicks or something, you know? When Mikasa and Levi heard Eren's roar, Titan roar, they decided to like hurry up and take a look. While Levi looks at his squad, his dead squad in pieces, you know, he couldn't do nothing but stare in cold misery without showing like much expression, you know. And we had to it the Mikasa sees that Eren gets eaten, but ends up being enraged to see the female Titan um take taking um taking him and goes into combat with her and manages to cut her legs, but that doesn't stop her. Levi shows up and tells her to fall back for now and ask um Mikasa if Eren's really dead, and Mikasa has yet to give an answer about that, and it ends there. So, you know, like I said, I'm just doing this for fun, and prep me up for season 2, just, even though I'm up to date with the manga. And I believe, like, in the next chapter of a Raw, or a translation or something, is supposed to come out, maybe sometime beginning of March this month, at least. But if anything else, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in my next video, so I'm off for zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye-bye.